Hey there, and welcome back to Cosmic Crypto. In this video, we're going to be talking about Ravencoin, RVN. Let's go. Okay, welcome back to the channel. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go down below, hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, if you can tap the like button, I would really appreciate it. Okay, I'm going to make these videos short tonight. Just got done with a one hour and 40 minute live stream. So, yeah, I just want to do some quick updates because not everybody likes the live stream format. So, we'll put a few videos out tonight as well. So, Ravencoin um, did not fall below this line here of 027 area. Uh, so, that's a good sign. Uh, my next price target below was down at the 025. And possibly all the way down to the 023. Now, we're not out of the woods yet. We had this falling wedge that was forming, and I said we could break out uh, of that area, which we did. But you can see from a fib from the top down to the bottom, uh, we are running right into the 786 fib level. Now, we're getting rejected here, but on the 12 hour time frame, we've got plenty of room on the indicators to run higher. Uh, let's go down to the four hour really quick. <clears throat> and you can see that. We're kind of overheated here, so it looks like we're about to print a red dot on the cipher down here. Um, so we did basically reach our price target. I was kind of hoping we'd get up to that 0328 area. Uh, we did not create a higher high here as well, so there is that. Um, but uh, this could just be a retest of the 618 down here, which is around the 0308 level, uh, and then maybe go sideways for a little bit, so that way the indicators can reset and then continue on to the upside. Uh, usually, so it's 11.38 p.m. my time, and so usually in about 3 hours and 22 minutes, uh, that's when we start to see some price action, so 3 a.m. my time is when we start to see some moves, and so possibly, it looks like the rest of the market is also cooling off, so I could totally see the market just go sideways here uh, until around 3 a.m. before we start to see the next leg uh, to the upside. Uh, but pay attention to this trend line that I've got here, the yellow um, diagonal line that's been holding our trend support for a while. We fell through it, was resistance for a minute, and then we broke back above it. So if we break back below this, and especially if we break below, I'm going to say if we break below the around the 0294 area, I'd start to get a little bit more concerned for a further breakdown. Uh, another thing I'm looking at here, just real quick, is we are in a kind of a um, broadening wedge that we're forming right here. So we've got the resistance up here, the support down here, and always with my broadening wedges, you know, we've got to, wherever the gap is, and we've got the gap at the high end right now, um, we need to fill that gap. Because uh, if we do not get back up and retest that, then that's telling me that we are rolling over to the downside. Uh, so pay attention to that as well. We do need to fill this gap up here. If we don't, then we could just break down out of this. And if we, again, like I said, if we get down to, and break down below this uh, support line here, uh, and then especially getting down below this um, these FIB levels over here, uh, I'd be very cautious that this was just a fake out to the upside. Um, but uh, we'll just have to wait and see. I think we're going to know a lot more in the next three or so hours. That's all I got today for Ravencoin. If you like this video, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button. Share it with your friends. And I will talk to you later.